He hasn't you know done what? enough. He responds immediately. He hasn't moved enough. Do you see, this is direct response to my 17 different attacks uh, on our him. Our viewers may remember uh, Stable Road Acquisition. It was only last week. They yeah. cut the price that they were paying for this momentous, basically in half, a satellite company. But the SEC has charged them uh, and uh, and come after them in a big way this, uh, this Did morning. They ever. I mean, you've got the complaint here. Where it's is brilliant. It? I hear it, it is. Back? The complaint's just nothing but brilliant. Yeah. Um, the... I've got the press release already. Oh, okay. You, well, okay you want the complaint? I got the complaint. No, no, no. Yes. I've read the complaint. I know. Well, Mikel. Okay, here's the complaint. And we're just holding it up for you so you can see it. Minister okay. of Proceedings. Uh, but let me give you the... Let me give you the specifics on it as you take a... By the way, still trading above 10. Well, that's um, crazy. Here's the quote from Gensler. Uh, 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 the, the case... Uh, well, let me get to the, the charges, okay? They allege the company misled investors. All right, now let's read the quote first. The case illustrates the risk inherent to SPAC transactions as those who stand to earn significant profits from a SPAC merger may conduct inadequate due diligence and mislead investors. And that's key to the case here, Jim. They allege the companies misled investors about their technology, about national security risks... Uh, in terms of the former CEO. Um, well, hold on, Dave. Come on, give the, an early state. Give the best line. Go ahead. Inve investors have been told that it successfully tested its proposal technology in space when, in fact, the company's only in space test had failed. Yes. Failed to achieve they, its they, prime, they, prime everything ability. Was, everything David, they was call it, here. They call it what? What is it called? What road? Stable road. Screen door slams. Yeah, screen door slams. Mary Trust <laughs> waves. Um, like a vision. Oh, man, what a song. Anyhow, uh, they also are saying, hey, if you were a pipe investor here, um, they're going to let you out. And, yeah. you know, they're going to pay $8 million in penalties. But the key here is if you're a pipe investor, you can say goodbye. By the way, he's forfeiting his 250,000 founder shares. Uh, but they came, right. they came hard here, uh, guys. And, well, and in part because, you know, that is the question, right? The sponsors um, are, you know, is the sponsor's economics aligned with General investors, not so much. Right. Not so much, because as I pointed right. out many times, many of them, given the compensation structure, can make money on this back, even if the stock were to fall to five, four, even as low as three in some cases. Whereas, of course, uh, for the right. investor out there, you want it to go up from 10, typically. Strangely, this one, I say strangely because there's so many questions early, about the business, David. even though it's they cut early. the price in half. It's still 61 cents above, whereas you're seeing many higher quality ones not I, above. I think I had a stable road last night. Or is it a Gar Narragansett? I don't know. Stable road. That's a um, great name right. for a bureau. They but ought to switch. You've been on Gensler. The SEC they makes, their, makes yep. a move on SPACs. Dave, it's I think, to, I have it's to tell important you, to note. I think they move with incredible speed, with efficiency, and creativity. I do. Okay. Oh, actually, no, that's a quote from the acting director. Like oh, a director comes, really imagine said. if the director comes out and says, I think my movie is great, it's efficient, it's fast. <laughs> it's Wouldn't you just say too. he's talking his book? Well, they're holding individuals accountable for their statements to investors which are particular concern when they're aimed at improperly capitalizing on public interest and popular investment vehicles such as oh. SPACs. Finally. You want to go with sponsors so you know do due diligence, but the fact is there's so many... SPACs chasing so few companies to I some know. extent that the companies can have their choice and say, well, uh, uh, actually, I want a higher price than that guy who's not doing any due diligence. Right. But can we'll hear from Kathy Wood tonight. She's backing away from Chinese SPACs, but she's been a, she's been a real space aficionado. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.